So guys, the new event week in GTA Online has just introduced some great ways to make money this week. And throughout the rest of this video, I will be sharing with you guys all of these methods. So without any further ado, guys, let's jump into the first money method. Now, this first money method will be the drag races. Now, in this recent event week, they do have some triple money and RP, which is absolutely huge. If you want to go ahead and start a drag race for yourself, just be in a GTA Online session, press the pause button, head over to this online tab, select jobs, play jobs jobs, Rockstar created, and then races. If you guys scroll down in this races tab, you will eventually find the drag races right here. Now they can be done solo, however I would probably not recommend doing it solo. I will show you guys what this is like. Now this really confused me because it does say custom vehicles either restricted or off. I'm going to put this as off. I will also set the class to sports. So it looks like we can't use our custom vehicles whatsoever warm up the tires to do a burnout now honestly i don't even know if i've done that properly you see in these drag races you have to use the shift up and shift down now honestly i have no idea what i'm doing i don't really do these drag races often but this is just point to point as well so it's not too bad to do I wasn't really paying attention to the road. <laughs> if you guys like doing these drag races, I would probably recommend doing them this week, especially with that huge three times money bonus. Now actually getting this right is kind of challenging. I'm definitely not doing this right. So we are going to see the payout for this. So we can see that I made $3,000. So I would definitely recommend playing this with other players. And you guys will probably understand how to do this better than me. Moving on to our next money method, guys. This will be very similar to this first one. This will be the drift races. Now, in my opinion, I just prefer the drift races over the drag races. It is less confusing in my brain. So to go ahead and start a drift race, you want to go over to the races tab once again. If we scroll down just further than the drag races, we will see the drift races with the triple money and our now i definitely prefer these drift races i just think they are so much more fun of course rockstar are adding this bonus into the game along with the drag races because of the new update which is going to be introducing some new vehicles i also believe that the creator mode will allow you guys to make these type of races so if i go ahead and start this i should be able to select one of my drifting vehicles this is my custom jester rr with the drift tuning kit in my opinion it is one of the best drifting vehicles i believe the best drifting vehicle overall is probably this one the fr36 you guys can also pick this up currently at the luxury autos dealership now it has been quite a long time since i have done a drift race but overall they are super fun to play even if you guys just do this solo you can really practice your drifting you can really get some good drifts here there's also some different multipliers in these different zones as well but you guys will see in the bottom right hand corner of the screen the longer you guys drift the higher score you do get for drifting now of course i only did one lap which just took me over one minute and of course our payout is very similar to the drag races so just like the drag races i would probably suggest playing them with other players or even just having a few more laps to maximize the amount of money you make for the six money method guys we do have some new community series jobs now like the other two money methods they will also have some triple money and rp unfortunately there is no new survivals so if you guys are a solo player like myself this is pretty much bad news however you guys can also do some really good new community jobs so if i go ahead and go to this job section press play jobs go down to community jobs and then just look through here we can see that this one does have the triple money and that p bonus they can be done solo some of these races and honestly they are really fun i mean just looking at the thumbnail for these races they do look insane of course there is no new survival it is only this survival i really wish that one of these survivals did have some triple money and that p but if you guys play with friends or even just random players i would highly suggest playing some of these things they will make you guys some great money and alongside this they are also really fun to play for our next money method guys we do have the new weekly challenge for this event so if we actually open our interaction menu and then scroll down to the challenges section we can then select the weekly challenge and see it right here so if you guys win two drag or drift races this will get you guys one hundred thousand dollars now unfortunately it does not seem to count if you guys do them solo so you will have to win them either with a friend and then take turns or just win them with some random players now honestly for the one hundred thousand dollars i would probably try and do this of course there is also that triple money and rp bonus on them races which definitely makes it a little bit better now guys for this next money method we are not even done with the bonus money for this one we do have some double money and rp on the wildlife photography challenge so at this ls tourist board if i walk over to it and press right on the d-pad i can see all of the animals that i need to take a photo of so i need to find 
a cat, a pig, and also a seagull. Now with this, you really just have to look around the map. There is sometimes specific locations where these animals will spawn. For example, a seagull should not be too far away from here, and I will be right back once I find a seagull. Two thousand years later so guys i can just about see a seagull here now this took me quite some time so i will quickly take a picture of one of these and we can see in the bottom right hand corner of the screen i can send this to the taurus bot so once done you will see that i should get some money for that and there we go we do get the forty thousand dollar award so from doing three of these each day you can get one hundred and twenty thousand dollars i'm not entirely sure if there is a additional bonus for doing this as well but just remember if you are struggling to find these specific animals you can just search it on google or something and it will show you guys a general location where to find them honestly this is not too bad for just flying around the map or anything and then just taking a picture of three different animals i would definitely say it is probably the easiest money method this week and of course you guys do not need anything to do this for this next money method guys we have the salvage yard daily income with some double money at the time of recording this video i do not have any salvage yard income this will be where you can find the safe though so you can press right on the d-pad at this wall and this will be where you can get your money. Now, if you guys want to increase your salvage yard daily income, you may have to salvage some vehicles by using this tow truck. Or if you guys do not have a tow truck, you can just salvage some of these other vehicles over on this computer. However, for the most part, I would probably not recommend doing that. We can see that you do lose quite a lot of the money if you guys decide to salvage it instead of just selling it. It really comes down to what you want to do. If anything, I would probably salvage the lowest vehicle. So this week, it is probably the Uber max sentinel classic but overall this won't be the best money method this week it's not too bad especially if you guys use the salvage yard and the tow truck quite often but if you guys do not do that then it is probably a waste of time it's also worth mentioning with the salvage yard the new salvage yard robberies are obviously in here this week so of course we have all of these free vehicles with the itali gto being a claimable vehicle as well which honestly i would 100 percent recommend that you try and get along with this the salvage yard does have a very nice discount this week so over on the Maze Bank Foreclosures website, we can see that we can save a lot of money. This also applies to its upgrades as well. So for example, if you guys just wanted to pick up a tow truck, it will cost a little bit less. It is still a lot of money, however. You could even go for the cheaper tow truck as well and save even more money. But overall, would I say this is worth it? Probably not. I would probably recommend just buying the salvage yard in itself. I don't even think that you guys even need a staff member. I mean, for this price, it is definitely not worth it, I would say. But you can make this money back through the salvage yard as well by doing the salvage yards robberies and now guys for our final bonus this week we of course have the time trials if you guys play any next gen consoles with the next gen version of gta online you can do the hsw time trial which is located over here and of course the standard or default time trial is located over here at galileo park now both of these time trials are by far the best ones to do just remember if you complete the part time you will not be able to do them again until the next event week now the best vehicle I find to use these time trials with is the HSW Hakachu Drag. It is by far one of my favourites. It just has the best traction in my opinion for a HSW vehicle. It is also super fast. I believe it is still the second fastest HSW vehicle. So it does make completing these part times very easy. You can see not really many HSW vehicles can do this. Just take corners with this much ease. If you guys also use the Hakachu Drag, I would also recommend pressing the handbrake on really tight corners. This honestly helps me so much. I've if you guys also lean forward on the bike this is how you guys achieve the maximum speed possible for the most part in these hsw time trials you can really get away with most hsw vehicles you can see that i just completed the part time here and i got the two hundred and fifty one thousand dollar award so honestly this is super easy to do i always suggest doing them every week for some of the easiest money you can make but anyways guys that will do it for this money methods video let me know in the comments down below what your favorite money method is this week honestly i do think this week has some pretty decent money money methods in terms of buying a business for example the salvage yard with its discount i would probably not recommend doing that and i would suggest just saving for the dlc instead so do maybe the wildlife photography challenge every day do the time trials and then play the drag drift races and the new community series jobs unless you guys already have the salvage yard then i would also suggest doing the salvage yard robberies but other than that that is probably it so yeah guys if you want to enjoy this video or found it useful in some way shape or form make sure to leave a like i really appreciate your support and if you guys are new here subscribe and hit that bell icon to never miss a video finally guys stay safe thanks for watching and i will catch you in the next one